that's who he stands for. Yes, boss. It's your boy just by the back in the video. Sorry, I kind of stuttered then. Um, this video would have come out a bit earlier, but I was spending two hours trying to make this thing work properly. Um, guessed by the title, yes, it is another custom Sonic. Um, in fact, I'm also building another one, but this one's going to have a slightly different design to the one that I've previously done, which you'll see in a minute. This is the inner workings for the next screwdriver. It's got a button as well, so that's good. Um, this is a little thing which would um, look like um, a Sonic Probe. That's what I'm building. I'm either building a Sonic Screwdriver or a Sonic Probe. It's one of the two. I don't know what what it is yet. I still need to find and make a body design for this. But it's all working. Um, I won't show it right now because that's a teaser. Um, speaking of screwdrivers, this is my custom. Yes, it looks like a Zivitz remote because it is or was a Zivitz remote. All I've done to it is I've replaced the speaker because this one um, it popped. So plus this came undone. So I've kind of unsoldered it. Took the took a an an ed, um took another one because I had a spare one. But it realised it was too big. So what I've done is I've took my one of the old earphone um, speakers so as a replacement. So it's a lot smaller and a lot more compact in there now. Um, speaking of compact, um, also the LED is now put in. It used to be a, a UV, it's not UV, what was it? Infrared light. It used to be one of those, but unfortunately it won't work because it's not an actual light. You need a camera to see it. So I've done my clever way instead of like unsoldering the full wires because I've only had a short piece of leg on my LED. I've basically bridged across the pegs. So I've also got this green on. It's actually still drying up slightly because what I've done, I've nicked blue tack with PVA glue because that will act as a strong bond. So I can actually get my hands on there. some super glue. Um, I've took the case, I've scratched it up a bit. That was already on there, um, but I've made it a bit more visible. Then I've added more dints and scratches in the soldering iron, make it look like it's been worn. Um, the battery pack. I've changed the screws because the previous screws were a bit rounded off and plus were a bit too small. These two screws came with the, which was attached to the TARDIS um, from the Fourth Doctor and TARDIS set, so I've used, reused those screws onto this, so it keeps it more closed in. Another screw on the top just to make it look like it's cobbled together really quick. Um, I weathered it, never mind that. It's got the speaker grill still. Um, as for the, as for the, now usually I attended it to be a static light, not to be flashing but obviously it's to do with the ball inside of there I didn't want to take the board out and just replace it with just wires and a switch I wanted to have sound as well because I kind of liked the um, the sound it just looks a bit more robotic so I thought I'll stick with the sound change the um, what you call it light um, infrared light I've, I changed it from that to an LED, a white LED. So here we go. And yet afterwards it still flashes. If I do a quick press, it still flashes. On the top, however, it's pretty hard to press because I've kind of done it in a way where I didn't want to use the top as much. But it's really hard. Wait, so. So I'm just going to keep using the bottom. So that is the my version and it even stands up. Now I call, I'm calling it a Sonic Probe because it's, it's more like a, it's not round, it's just a, a type of thing like a probe. 
based on it's kind of based on well I'm doing I'm, I'm thinking of doing one based on the design of the one where Amelia Pond uses a sonic device um, but I just fancied a change from a sonic screwdriver to a probe um, I got it took me about two hours to get it right and I need to get some more solder because I've nearly like ran out wait is my soldering iron cold down? yes it has, good but it's not away but however I am pretty pleased with it um, I might add to it in the future if I do I'll, sh I'll show you guys now I was going to tend to put this on it just to make it look like I've actually just cobbled, t cobbled it together so looks more like that and then the and you could like download some data through this which was a former power bank the old one um, I've got a pen, went over it, did that let's get into the imperfections on the plastic um, quite like it I'm still trying to think if I'm going to add something else to it but at the minute this is what it's a bit like um, I call it a sonic probe um, it 